Hey everyone, today I'm going to talk you through the renin angiotensin aldosterone system in 60 seconds, the function of which is to maintain your blood pressure and fluid balance. It starts with the release of renin in the kidney, which converts angiotensinogen made in the liver into angiotensin 1. The lungs produce angiotensin converting enzyme, which turns this into angiotensin 2. This goes on to do four main things. Firstly, causing an increase in sympathetic nervous activity, causing widespread vasoconstriction. Next, it causes release of antidiuretic hormone from the posterior pituitary in turn, leading to increased water resorption in the collecting ducts. The third effect is sodium and chloride uptake from the tubules to retain water and increase blood volume. And lastly, causing aldosterone release from the adrenal cortex, upregulating the action of basolateral sodium potassium pumps and increasing synthesis of ENAC sodium channels, leading to retention of water by osmosis. The combined effect of all these processes increases the perfusion pressure of the juxtaglomerular apparatus, in turn decreasing the amount of renin produced via negative feedback, and the cycle repeats.